recording late at night it is probably 1 30 at night right now but it's okay because this look came out good after everything like i didn't have enough memory my battery was good but besides that like you know the video still came out good and it is here so without further ado this is a juvia's place palette or juvia's basically the foundation and concealer review but guys that's pretty much really what this video is about. It's about the foundation and the concealer. I already did one eye off camera because I know this isn't really about the eye look, but this is also a fall look. That's why I'm gonna do one eye on camera as well, right into the video. Cause I, like I said, I already did one eye. And most of the eye, uh, most of the, here we go. Here we go with me blinking out. Most of the, oh, I'm dropping shit already. I meant not to curse tutorial very soon so to start off i'm gonna be using the juvia's place palette and the color of the nubian 2 i want to show it to you guys but it's pretty hard to see so i'm gonna go in this orange color is my transition color so the next palette i am using is the color pop x's and o's and that palette i'm gonna be using a brown color as well and it's called hooky and i'm using that right in my crease as well i'm going to that same x's and o's palette and this color is called reckless and I'm gonna go ahead and start darkening my crease up a little bit. And I'm using a deeper precision um, brush and it's really a, um, like a crease brush, but it's more of a, more of a dis, um, precision. I think by, it's by Authentic Organics um, Cosmetics. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just keep working that only, and as you can see, I'm only leaving that color right in the crease so the transition colors in the back obviously and then this color is going to be more up front i'm just gonna start in the middle Pretty much what I did, I'm gonna set that up with some powder. You always wanna set your concealer with powder. I'm using the Morphe setting powder in the color um, Light Banana. For the color for my lids, I am using the BH Cosmetic Color Palette, 25 color palette. And I'm just applying this orange right on top of where I just cut out my crease. And you see how smoothly I'm just tapping that in in this palette and I'm just gonna darken my crease again. So if you can see the deep how it's getting deeper and the crease is getting a little darker as well. So I'm going back in the this palette and I'm going back in with that Zoho color and I'm gonna apply it right on top of where I just darkened. This look, um, like I said, is pretty easy. It looks crazy right now, so I'm just going to use a black eyeliner, and it's just a regular eyeliner. So, I'm going to go ahead and use my Bad Girl Bang by Benefit. 
mascara to just get my lashes ready for the falsies. Alright guys, so I already applied glue to my lashes um, off camera, but real quick before I apply the camera, um, before I apply the lashes on, I went to work with these lashes on and I'm gonna look down and my first of all my team and my coworkers they be like cut like they be coming at me. they're like oh my god these look like you brooms like like you could sweep up i'm like i could sweep up the floor are you guys kidding me but anyways i love my dramatic lashes unfortunately so like i said i'm just gonna apply these lashes if you're not into dramatic lashes you could opt out but like i said this is what i like so that's why i made that joke because i'm like Everybody be talking like mad crap about these lashes. So I'm just going to try to apply them as close to my lash line as possible. on my arm and I am literally I'm just gonna tap that right into my skin I'm using the um, 310 by Juvia's Place and I apply like literally a dime size on the back of my hand and I'm just using a brush, a flat top. I'm still old school. I still use a brush and I'm just pretty much done with applying my foundation. So now I'm going to go ahead and get into concealers. So I used um, both of the concealers as you can see both the 13 and the 14. I'm going to start with the 14 first obviously and I'm gonna go ahead and do th just three lines and just apply that on blender um, I use my beauty blender to go ahead and blend that under my eyes that in make sure your beauty blender is really damp and all like not too damp but damp enough that it blends but it doesn't soak up the product too much and this is 13 and just applying a little less on the forehead area and the chin area as well And as you can see, it's also cleaning up the, it's also cleaning up your, give me a minute guys, your eyeshadow. So that's why I always do my eyes first. I know a lot of people have been doing um, their concealer and foundation first, but I still do my concealer second because I like to clean up my um, eyeshadow with that. my Morphe um, setting powder and I'm just gonna tap that in with this actually this is a um, glow brush but I use it as a setting powder instead and we're basically baking now so as I was telling you before I am using the Saharan blush palette in the volume one I can't wait for volume two this is what it looks like and I am going to use this angled brush and it's a angled contour brush and I'm going in the color Neo first 
Well, the color's called Neo, but I'm going into it first, and it's the middle color here. Right here. And I'm dragging that more upwards rather than downwards. So, like I was just saying, I want to apply that to the perimeter of my face. I don't worry. contour palette that I have. Now, I can't really remember where I got this contour palette from, but I'm going to blend that. And I'm just going to blend that upwards into my eyeshadow. And I usually use my um, other, actually, if you can't find this contour palette, I use my face powder as well, which is the Kat Von D um, powder, but I'll go ahead and hit. But I'm using this Kat Von D powder, and it's in the color Deep 72. And I still have not blended out my under eyes and I'm gonna go ahead and do that now as well and I just want Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and use the same palette and use this blush color right here. And it's called Tobe. I'm just going to apply that right on top of the... And now, I thought, I know you guys were thinking, what am I going to do under my eyes? I'm going to go ahead with this black liner. And just start smoking that out. So it's going to be more of a dark brown. So keep doing that. So I'm just going to add a little bit of orange right under there because we want to go ahead and balance up and down. So just applying that orange right under there. And called bright and bubbly if you guys can see it it's right under my brows all right so what I'm gonna do is going back into the X's and O's palette and I'm going this color called no better and it's really a shimmer color and I'm going right into my inner tear duct my face now we're gonna jump right into the lips i'm using this nyx color and it's called espresso this is one of my favorite so i'm going in with anastasia's um, Beverly Hills Naked Liquid Lipstick. It's called Naked.
So I think I'm going to keep this color, this lip matte because I don't want to do a gloss because I feel like I always do a gloss lip. So let's just go ahead and keep it matte today for y'all for something new. I'm going to come back with a full look and hopefully you guys like this look. And I will tell you guys, I do love the Juvia's Place or Juvia's. That's really what this video is about. It's about the foundation and the concealer. If you guys want to see a, another look or if you guys want to see any requested look, follow me on Instagram. I will have that link down below. And I will also have it in my intro and my outro. So you guys will have my information. So if you want to see more looks, if you want to see this look, um, as far as like picture wise, definitely go on Instagram. I will have it posted up. But if you guys like this look, thumbs it up. Um, thank you for watching. Thank you guys for coming back with me. You guys like this look. And if you use Juvia's Place palette, let me know if you like it as much as I do. Because I sure do. Bye. See you guys in the next video as usual. Per <laughs>